you in the in terms of the songwriting process, there's an interesting thing. You were one of my good friends is Kurt Vile. And Oh yes. He's, he's you know, he's one of my I've known him for however long and just I uh, love him to death. And you worked with Kurt on in, in the songwriting process a little bit. Can, uh, yes. Can I tell you a funny story? Actually, it involves oh. you. Sure. Um, it's the best okay, kind well, of story. I know. You're going to love it. So first of all, I have to say my ex is so pissed. I'm talking to you because he's the one that showed me who you are. Okay. And he listens to this and he's like, please don't ever go on this show. So I can, I can never, like, I can't not listen. So sorry, sorry. buddy. Sorry. But second of all, I, I thank him because through listening to your show, mm-hmm. I started hearing Kurt like drop in and be a weirdo. Uh-huh. And I always loved Kurt and listened yeah. to his music, but listening to your show, listening to him talk on your show was the reason I reached out to him to write. Oh, that's amazing. So you reached out to Kurt because you heard him be a goofball with me on the show. Yes. And what what is it? What were those things about his music that popped for you initially before you knew him as a person? Uh, I think that he has a combination of severe talent and humor, mm-hmm. and he's just like painstakingly cool. Yes, he's he is that person. Like that's that's my favorite thing about Kurt is. The person who I have know in real life and the person who I, you see on stage, that's literally the same guy. There's yeah, no... and he's like, he's the man. He's such a nice mm-hmm. person. I love nice people. Yeah. Too. Mm-hmm. And sometimes when you're like a really cool guy, mm-hmm. you're not always that nice, but he's like a cool guy that's really nice. He is, yeah. Do you know about his brother, Paul, Jello Man? I do. Tell me about Jello Man. Kurt's brother, Paul, uh, goes to festivals and he brings Jello shots and he sells Jello shots at different uh, music festivals all across the country. And his he's known as Jello Man. The first time I met him, this giant Breaking Bad style RV pulled up and he had coolers of Jello shots that he was just making to take to EDM festivals or Coachella. And, and at first they started to throw him out of these things, but now they're just like, Hey, Jello man. So he's now a legend. Is he single? (laughs) I don't, I don't know. I'll find (laughs) out for you. He's a, he's a strapping young man though. He does uh, a lot of Mason work too. So he's, he's, uh, He's a tough guy. Wait, look, this could be. Uh, this, could this could be, be it. This could be it. <laughs> you'll watch this. You'll watch this video. Forty years from now, you and Jello Man will watch the moment you learned about Jello Man. Little Jello babies. <laughs> Little Jello babies. Yeah. <laughs> 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 